Austin. What do you mean? He just disappears. No one just disappears. We all witnessed a miracle. He saved my daughter. Hey yo, what's up everybody, welcome back to the channel, it's your boy Jesse Keegan and we are Funny and Jesse, so right about now we're going to do another reaction video and um, this one right here is kind of, uh, we're doing a trailer today, I mean we're going to watch a trailer together and this trailer is called uh, Messiah and uh, how, um, I know a lot of people have heard about this series, it's on Netflix kind of controversial type of, uh, of a series and a lot of people are talking about um, the messiah on this series is Dajjal or something like that so um, let's watch it together and let's see uh, what this series is all about and probably we can discuss more and uh, yeah so without any further ado guys let's get it he's come out of nowhere and we don't know who he is what do we know about him? He's leading desperate people. So this is a cult? We don't know who he's associated with. He could be creating an army. Or he could be leading them to their death. What are you doing in Syria? Did you bring a message? A message from him. My father. And who is your father? He's lost it. What do you mean? He just disappears. No one just disappears. We all witnessed a miracle. He saved my daughter's life. You need to see this. <laughs> Bury it for as long as you can. He didn't just click his heels and end up here. He clearly had help. You get around Syria, Israel, Texas. It's the nature of my work. And what is that work? God's work. Who do you think he is? You didn't see what I saw. And if I did, would I be calling him the second coming? How far will this new movement spread? I'm going to find out everything about you. This is bigger than what you can imagine. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Uh, such an amazing trailer anyway so um there's been a lot of speculations that uh the movie portrays uh the false prophet dajjal who's going to come here and pretend to uh to be a healer and healing people and uh bring peace to the people and whatnot but in the actual sense is the antichrist and uh, I know a lot of people are gonna be desperate enough to follow the guy just like the way people are following him in the series as we watched together you could see like a lot of people are desperate and they're trying to follow him whatever he's going to and whatnot and he's gonna have I mean same powers I mean he's gonna have powers he's gonna heal people he's gonna uh, stop rain he's gonna create rain he's gonna all these things is gonna happen under his probably um, regime or whatnot, but again, you have to understand that um, not everyone is going to follow him. I mean, there are few people who will actually understand that this one is the judge. And if you are wise enough, or if you um, awaken enough, you'll actually understand that this guy over here is the judge and is not uh, the real Christ or whatnot. So the question is, um, do you think that, um, is he going to appear soon enough or is it going to take time for him to come? Because um, as you know, we're in 2020 and uh, a lot of things are going to happen in 2020. A lot of technology is going to 
come up, come up. A lot of uh, catastrophes are going to happen. A lot of um, a lot of things are going to happen in 2020. Is this uh, one of them? Is this one of them, or is this one of the things that is going to happen in 2020, or probably it's going to happen in this decade that we live in today? Are we going to experience the jal in 2020, or are we going to experience the jal in this decade? Just let me know the comment section below. What do you think? I believe that it's coming soon and I mean people should be prepared. You see, what's really good is that this movies or this series that, that we normally watch every day, they give us like subliminals, messages. Like for example, this movie Messiah over here, you can actually see what they're trying to uh, to tell us, you get it. I mean, it's it's something that you just don't watch to enjoy, but watch to decode and try and find out why are they show why are they showing this movie to us at this particular time? Why is it that they had to wait up to 2020 to show us this movie? Why couldn't it come before 2020, or why couldn't it come like like 2030 or whatnot? Is it the preparation, or is it that they are trying to condition us so that? When it happens, we can be reluctant enough or it's just to prepare us psychologically and uh, so that we get deceived when the child just comes in. But again, um, if just like I said, if you're wise enough, if you're wise to um, get one and two together, you will actually understand and know that the Messiah that you're being shown over here is actually a deceiver. Anyway, but again, we really have to be very careful. What if what they're trying to show us probably is going to be the real uh, uh, Christ or something, or probably is going to be not the deceiver. Maybe it's going to be the person who's going to save the world or something like that. You get it? Because uh, there they're going to be a lot of war. Trust me, there's going to be a lot of war. And then one person going to come in as a savior. So we don't know whether this person is going to be the Dajjal is going to be the real savior. But anyway, if you are at the level of understanding and if you are at the level of awakening and you have full of wisdom, you'll actually be able to differentiate between the Dajjal and the real savior. But anyway, I feel this series, I don't know if I should tell you guys to go and watch the series or something or you could just no, watch it. If you feel like if you're going to watch it, you're going to be deceived or you're going to be conditioned, don't don't watch it. But if you want to find more information or if you want to find more, uh, 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 I mean, information, just go watch it. I mean, it's, it's not a bad thing to watch. You can you can you can actually uh, get one or two information from 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 the movie and you will try to decode it by yourself. And I think it's telling us a lot of things. And uh, you know how we started 2020. You know this World War Three that is is uh, actually um, planned to happen, of which I hope is not going to happen. And so many things. Australia is burning. I mean, a lot of animals, like 500 million animals, just died in Australia. There's a lot of uh, catastrophes all over the world. I mean, there's uh, uh, floods uh, around the world, some parts of the world, or something like that. So. All these things were dated to happen, you get it. When you read the Bible, the Quran, all these things have been prophesied. But again, we have to be careful enough uh, to actually know who are the real people that we are engaging in with. Even the friends that you, 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 you're with, even the people that you're with. I mean, at this time and age, you need to be really awakened. You really have to be at a different level. To be able to distinguish between this and that, between the good and evil. I'm not advocating for you guys to go watch the series, but if you really feel like you want to watch the series to get more information, just go on and watch it. I think there's so much information in here that you need to, to know or you need to see. And probably if you watch it, um, you're going to find... Um, you're going to be able to decode it. If you feel like I reacted to this video in a better way, just give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to go down in the comment section and tell me exactly what you feel about my reaction. What do you feel about this series over here, Messiah? There's a lot of, but then there's a lot of speculation. They're saying that, uh, okay, since this movie is, uh, is from the United States and whatnot, there's so, I mean, there's so much speculation. There's so much, people don't like the series uh, to start with. They say like it's, um, 
they are using religion for their own benefit. You understand? Like they, uh, of course, they're going to make a lot of money out of this series. So they're using religion to make money. They are actually um, using um, religion in a in a you know I mean to deceive people and all these kind of things. I mean, there's so much that people are talking about this. Series. I mean, there's so much. There are so many reactions out there, and a lot of good reactions, and again, and uh, a lot of bad reactions. But anyway, I hope I've just told you what the movie. I hope you just enjoy the the. the the trailer and if you want to go watch it just go watch it and the most important thing is don't forget to subscribe to our channel the more you keep subscribing the more you give us the motivation to do a lot of videos and to give you better better content and last but not the least i'm gonna see you rather we're gonna see you in the next video and peace out